she like to do my sunshine Nigga talk my game, we gon' turn this shit to Columbine Ice on my neck, cost me ten times through Thirty thousand dollars for a nigga to get free Hi YouTube, it's Nia Elise. Welcome back to my channel. Of course, back to school time is here. It's past approaching. It's here. So this is going to be a clothing haul showing you guys everything that I got. It's all over here lined up in the corner beside me to show to you. I chose to go during my state's tax-free weekend. It was crazy. It was crazy. But I caught some good deals and I'm glad of that. Also, I want to mention the reason that this video is not a try-on is because I'll be doing a lookbook like next week sometime so I'm just gonna save it for that because most of the stuff that I bought for back to school will be included in my lookbook not all of it but most of it so I'm just not gonna do a try on for that reason but if you're interested in watching this haul then stay tuned the first store that I'm gonna start with is Air Postal technically this isn't a part of my back to school shopping I got it like a month ago but I haven't worn it yet and I'm gonna wear it to school so it's in the video and it is a tank top crop style shirt well not crop style it looks like a crop top very much but it fits like my body it covers my stomach completely and this is in a size small and it just has an A on it and my middle name is Elise so I just couldn't pass it up and it originally retailed for $24.50 but I'm gonna have the real price like printed somewhere on the screen the next store in this haul is going to be Rue 21 Route 21 is like, oh my god, I love that store. I, so I'm really trying to switch my style up this year because I'm like such a girly girl. I don't know what's wrong with me, but I'm just such a girly girl. So I went to the boys section of Route 21 and I bought this. It is a Tupac shirt, nothing special really. I mean, I could see a girl wearing this, which is why I bought it. It's not like too out there, but I thought it was cute. And I bought it kind of big on purpose. It's in a size medium because I figured it's going to shrink in the wash. And it's a boy style so I didn't want to buy it tight fitting like girl clothes. The next thing I got from the 21 are two skirts. I got this blush colored one. And it just has slits on both sides as you can see. And the skirts were two for the price that's listed on the screen. So I also got this one. And it has like elephants printed on it and it has slits on both sides just like the pink one and both of the skirts are in extra small last things I got from Rue 21 are these two shirts which were also on sale they were buy one get one five but I'll list the individual price for each shirt I got this mustard yellow shirt because I thought it went with um, this skirt very well so I got that and this is in a size medium I tried an extra small. I didn't even try it on at the store. I just bought it because I think I'm little. What's wrong with me? I It didn't work. Okay. This is a medium. And then I got this white one because like I said, they were on sale. So I got this white one which stretches much more than the yellow one. Like you guys see how much it stretches. So I was able to get away with a small in this one. So the next store that I'm going to feature in my haul is Rainbow. I'm going to apologize in advance for the loudness of the bag, Rainbow. And I'm just showing you guys the bags just in case like you're unfamiliar with the store. And it's a haul. Why would I not? So I got three dresses from Rainbow and a pair of sandals. So this is the first dress. It's just a navy blue and white dress. And it has like full coverage sleeves so it's very school appropriate unlike some of the stuff I bought I'm going to be wearing jean jackets every day and it has a slit in the front and like I said all these dresses are medium so next I got this black and white striped shirt dress I almost said shirt I really do this black and white striped dress but it's kind of like a t-shirt dress it has a collar and then it has the cap sleeves with the buttons and it also features a belt which is the same texture of the dress if I can find it yeah so that is that and the last dress that I purchased from Rainbow is also this one and this dress both are school appropriate like I did not think they were going to be long enough but I did try these on but 
that was the first store I went to, but as the day progressed, I got tired of trying on clothes. But it's this maroon bodycon style dress, and it just has like little striped lines in it, and it's a turtleneck, and it's just short of being quarter sleeve. And the last thing I got from Rainbow are these really cute sandals. And these are in a size seven and a half. And they look like this and they have the little buckle straps. The next store I went to was Forever 21. And I got two things from there. One thing was these jeans, which were a steel. They're dark denim jeans regular waisted but I can kind of pull them up a little bit but um yeah these jeans were bomb like when I tried them on I fell in love and when I saw the price I married them these jeans are in a size 27 second thing I really did not need but it was this sweater it was on sale and they had this pretty purple tag on it to let me know it was on sale but it's a rose colored sweater and it has a very low dip and this is in a size small so that's the other thing I got from forever 21 and this is outfit honestly like when it gets fall time you will definitely see me pairing this with some booties the next store I went to I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys JCPenney who doesn't love JCPenney these are the other two boy shirts I was discussing I got this one which is like a green color and then it has pink pineapples on it and little hints of yellow, plenty of white, and it's just the same front and back. And this is actually a extra small, but it's a boy's shirt, so it's kind of on the big side. The next thing I got from JCP is this other boy's shirt. It's actually collared, and both of these shirts are Arizona jean shirts, which is like a JCPenney brand. And this one is in a medium, but it's a button-up aztec print shirt with a pocket and i just thought it was adorable and like the price was even cuter so i got it next girl you gotta support your sisters so i got two bras from jc penny they were on sale for like a really good price because these are good quality bras and they retail for 20 dollars each and they were on sale for the price that's up there so this is like a nude colored one and then it has pink cups on the inside and then this next one is a love of my life it's black and white with like a really cute cool design and then it's like bright 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 yellow on the inside of the bra so couldn't pass that up that was a really good deal for two bras the last clothing store that I went to was Charlotte Russe they got me okay Charlotte Russe is expensive if you buy like full price stuff that's not on sale but I actually made off like a bandit to be honest because I got some good stuff so I actually went to Charlotte Russe on two separate occasions I just went on Sunday today's Tuesday because the first time I went I saw this and I was like you don't need it you don't need it you don't need it and Sunday I had to go back to the mall to take that Rue 21 shirt back so I was like you do need it you get that bag girl so I got this and it's like a rose gold wallet purse like I don't know not even rose gold it's pink but it's like a pale pink a really pale pink but I keep calling it a purse because I want to make myself believe that it's a purse because the price I paid for it I wouldn't pay that for a wallet but it has a strap on it so it's a purse right and you can make it a wristlet so I thought it was worth it but literally it's just a wallet <laughs> I'm facing reality then we unzip it it has wallet like compartments and I'm actually it's gum in here because this is my new current bag because my last current bag was the same color and I just feel like this is a really functional color matches any and everything for the most part also from Charlotte Russe on a different day I got two pairs of pants so I got some skinny khakis And these are in a size 6. And Charlotte Russe had their pants. They were buy one, get one pair for $12.50. Of course, you had to pay for the more expensive pair of the two. So, um, I'm going to list the price of both pairs individually just in case you missed the sale. 
not sure how long it's going on I just know I caught it and I caught it on tax free weekend so it worked out really good for me and I've been dying for a pair of light wash jeans so I got these and these are in a size 8 I did not think they would fit and they're not like extremely tight fitting but they're not like boyish baggy and they have rips in both knees and of course they're skinny like all my pants next store that I'm gonna feature is gonna be journeys got a, oh shoot you guys probably already saw that I wanted to cover the price but look it is a Tootsie Roll shaped black purse with short straps y'all want to know what sold me the purse also features a messenger strap so you can carry it like the other purse that I just showed you like what's not to love this bag was everything and so much more when I saw it like I almost screamed in the middle of the store and journeys was packed they would have been right but girl and then that price tag when I saw that this purse was $9 I almost knocked a cashier over to get to it but I got my bag so I was happy about that okay guys the next store don't sleep on this store okay people where I live because I don't know if you guys have one where you're at but it's like another rainbow you can compare it to Conway's if you live like up north it's city trends people around here are like oh my gosh you shop at city trends you have to look for the good stuff so first is another purse it is this white and gold tote bag and it's leather only thing I wish it had the little stoppers on the bottom for like when you sit on the floor just to protect the bottom of the bag from touching the floor but it is a huge bag on the inside I've carried it for like pretty much all summer until I um, started carrying my other bag which was like the pinkish color and um I just love this bag so much the next bag I got was this Kenneth Cole reaction and this palm I also got the palm from City Trends this is like in a teal color I wanted to say green but there's nothing green about this this is really like a teal purse and this is a name brand purse people sleep on city trends so hard for what this is a name brand purse brand spanking new like it's a logo on the inside and it's like all in general a nice bag like there's nothing wrong with this bag at all so I was really really happy that I got that as well I'm really into like purses the next store I'm going to feature in my haul is Waltimart no nah, seriously Walmart um Charlotte Ruse had the exact same thing that I got from there, but it was a girl in my way and I could not find my size. So I was like, I'm just going to get them from Walmart like I always do. So who really wants to be cleaning white shoes? Not me. I buy at least three pairs of these every year from Walmart. They are just some plain old all white shoes. If you have a problem with it, I'm sorry. These are like my go-to's on a lazy day you're not gonna feel like putting on your good shoes and these are in a size six last but most certainly not least kids foot locker your girl got a baby foot and I really do not know this but um, I purchased these shoes from kids foot locker forgot I think it was like a week or two ago but these are some adidas superstars and these are in a size five and a half in kids they're too big for me so I tried to hit Adidas up but they had me on hold for like not Adidas kids foot locker up and uh, they had me on hold for like 10 minutes so I hung up because I was like where you at though but I got the white with the um, black trim but yeah like I said I have to take them back I'm gonna try to call them back I don't feel like riding Florence anymore but I'm gonna try to call them back probably tomorrow so I can see if I can go over there and get a smaller shoe but anyway you guys that completes this haul I hope you guys enjoyed it thanks so much for watching I promise I'm going to try to start uploading more frequently please stay tuned for my lookbook um, I'm thinking I'm going to include five outfits in the lookbook so just stay tuned for that thank you guys so much for watching please like this video and subscribe to my channel to see more content from me bye you guys